When clutter conquers your home, you will be likely to blame your small house. You think you do not have ample space for shelves, dressers, cabinets, or other storage to stash away less used items. Well, you may have more storage space than you think you do. It is just lying dormant and waiting for you to tap into. These 12 clever organization projects to occupy unused space can help you. So, let's check them out. And as always, SimFoam Compiled Ad presented you with this list. Number 12. The DIY Kitchen Alcove Building Idea at On A Budget Official The corner usually remains untouched because it's too small, making it impractical. Did you know it is possible to tap into this awkward space effortlessly? Do not let it remain dormant. If you have this awkward space in your kitchen, you can use it as a cozy coffee station to refresh your morning mood. The coffee station does not have to be complicated, though. It can be as simple as installing shelves to store sugar, coffee, and knickknacks. Under the shelves are a cabinet and countertop that help you stash away clutter and prepare your morning coffee. Number 11. How to produce your own cute coffee station corner via at Lori's Cardina idea. Try this one instead if you think the previous idea is too much trouble because working with screws and saws is not your thing. This coffee station does not require any advanced carpentry skills. You just need to explore your creativity and imagination. First, you have to wipe down the countertop. A clean and shiny countertop is a perfect start for your cozy coffee station. Then, gather the decor you like. After that, lay a tray or cutting board on the countertop to help you anchor your canisters and saucers. To make the coffee station look more appealing, you can hang artwork or an inspirational quote. But wait, damaging the beautiful backsplash is not on your list, is it? Thus, you can try using command strips to attach the artwork. It is super easy and will not ruin the wall. Number 10. How to turn unused space into a comfy reading nook from at at Carly Ray Interiors. You need to make little measurements and plan to copy the idea. Next, gather your accessories, mix and match those properties, and use a hammer and nails to put the pieces together when necessary. Finally, use a marker to write inspirational quotes on the wall representing your values. Additional accessories you can add, such as 1. A flower pot garden planter box 2. A wood decking 3. A pallet art 4. The metal table legs and wooden shelving unit 5. A mid-century chalkboard wall art 8. A sofa table display case this provides a large area to work on. It also has large storage space and is portable. In this case, it allows the audience to get hands-on with you and learn how they can apply your ideas in their lives. Number 9. A Quarter Moon Corner Shelving Idea from Bosch This one is another way to tap into awkward space. You might think that you can just purchase some ready-made shelves for a corner in your house. Unfortunately, not all corners come precisely 90 degrees, making it harder to find a perfect fit. Therefore, you need to consider constructing it yourself. First, you need to measure the angle of the corner and then transfer the radius onto the wooden boards. After that, Cut out the shelves. Next, measure and cut the support strips to length. Then, drill some holes from the mounting brackets 
after sanding rough edges. Finally, mount the boards and support strips after painting them. Number 8. Awesome idea to convert a stair landing to a home office from At Mal Madness. How to avoid starring a dead space ahead when you can't handle the stressful screen anymore. This stair landing is literally a dead end. If you had this kind of space at home, you would probably use it to house unused items, pretty much the same as a storage room in the attic. Instead of using it as a storage room or abandoning it, you can turn it into a stylish home office. First, you have to clean the space thoroughly. Then, apply some coats of paint to refresh the look. You can also add some interesting geometric shapes to the wall using painter's tape and black color. If you think it is not enough, a few framed pictures will come in handy. Since the space is tight, you need to make some floating shelves to store things without taking up available floor space. You can also display some knickknacks to personalize it. You may also need to make your own desk if you cannot find one that fits in this tight space. Finally, lay a rug to make it look more appealing and comfortable. As a bonus, you can enjoy a spectacular view when tired of staring at the screen all the time. Number 7. The Turning Point DIY Corner Shelving Idea from Woodshop Diaries If you dwell in a small house, every inch will matter to you, including the corner in every room. You can use this spot by making a corner shelf. Making a corner shelf is not that hard. You will need 1x8 lumber to provide deep storage for books and flower pots. If you need a deeper one, you can go with a 1x10. After that, cut the board into two pieces of 30 inch long and four pieces of 12 inch long. Then assemble them. Number six. How to turn a sad corner into your own yoga center from at Lorad26. Doing yoga can help you stay calm. However, this idea seems impossible if you do not have a serene space to do it in. Well, you can turn the unused room in your house into a home yoga studio. First, you need to refresh the look. If the room has wallpaper on the wall, you can remove it. However, it may take time. Therefore, you can simply paint the entire walls or cover them with shiplap paneling. Then, hang some shelves and add some personal touches as you desire. You can also bring in some greenery to enliven the space. To attach the wooden panels securely to the wall, you can also use command strips if you don't want to give your wall permanent damage and the size is not as large as that in the video. Once you hang it on the wall, an interesting twist will occur. The effect is that it gives you a sense of balance and harmony. If you have to make a corner in your living room, you can use the space creatively by designing a corner shelf and turning it into something beautiful and useful. If you like this idea, check out the video to know more details. Number 5. $8 can go a long way too. The DIY Pottery Barn Floating Shelving Idea from Emmy Lou Designs. Floating shelves are incredibly versatile. Besides, they can be your safe bet when it comes to limited space. If you want to use the versatility of a floating shelf, but loathe the hassle, you can try this ready-made shelf. It features a board with a notch that will hold the shelf in place. You just need to screw the notch on the wall. That's it. However, if you are not worried about the budget and want to spend less time building this shelf, you can try this idea. First, you need to start with a 4x4 inch wood 
and cut two pieces 24 inch long. Then, attach two pieces of 1 by 4 inch wood at each end using a 3 quarter inch Craig Jig pocket hole system to make two floating shelves. To further update it and make it more unique, you can paint the wood, add a cute graphic, and make a hole for an electrical cord to pass through. If you are looking for a storage solution without spending lots of money, you need to consider this step. You can use this for many things and find creative ways to personalize it. This simple shelf cabinet will come in handy when storing your indoor plants, books, etc. You can turn almost any wall space in a home into a storage solution with the help of little known materials like boxes, containers, and lumber. Number four, the sweet and inspiring corner floating desk with IKEA and the Sorry Girls. IKEA is almost always awesome. However, some products do not fit in with the corners of your room. If that is the case, you need to consider adding a twist to it, just like this corner floating desk. To make this floating desk, you will need two IKEA Ekby Alex, four IKEA Sand Schult wall brackets, a one and a half inch sheet of plywood board, and four handles. Then, cut two large pieces of plywood at 70 inch by 11 and 5 eighths inch to create the top and bottom. You will also need to cut one corner of each piece at a 45 degree angle so that they can fit in with the corner. This cutting is for one floating desk. Since you have two desks, you have to repeat the cutting for the other one. You will also need to make rectangular drawer front pieces to create a sleeker look. Number three, how to transform an unusable cupboard and transform your bedroom almost entirely. An unused closet leaves an open space that can be an eyesore. You can turn it into a more functional and beautiful spot by using masking tape to create geometric forms and some fresh coat of paint. Begin with forming the geometric shapes you want. Then, paint the wall. Finally, place your bed in it. It is easy, right? Number two, the beautiful corner wall art with its own lighting installation. This one will provide ample space to store things and offer a breathtaking look that can steal anyone's focus. To create these corner shelves, you will need IKEA square deck palettes, simple black square pieces of wood or shelves, LED lights, and any decorative items you want to display. After that, you need to assemble the palettes by cutting off the back legs and screwing them together. You can place your decorative items on the shelves. The lights should fit under the shelf. In addition, you can hang decorative items on the wall if it is not too tight. This idea is a nice addition to any corner of your room where you need more storage space without much effort. Before I finish this countdown, support the channel by pressing subscribe button under the video. Please keep us in your subscription tabs for more home and garden improvement ideas like this. And finally, Let's close our countdown with... Lastly, number one, the DIY corner shelves for your unappealing corner area at at Morley Kurt. Who says that making corner shelves is hard? You can try this simple idea. First, you just need to mount a square wooden dowel in the corner. Then, screw two L brackets onto it. After that, Top the brackets with a triangular wooden board that fits the corner perfectly. Repeat the steps to get as many shelves as you want. The main element of the idea is only the L brackets, so when you are ready to clean the area, 
you just need to remove the brackets and slide the shelves out. You can also attach hooks for hanging the books if you decide to try the idea for your bedroom. First, screw them into the top of the brackets. After that, you can use wooden strips or rope to attach shelves to the corner. This DIY corner shelf project is cheap, but durable as well. When you try this idea for your living room, you can paint the shelves to fit your interior design or add more items to them like photos and plants. Every inch of your house can make great storage. You just have not realized it yet. Now, look around to find the potential spot. Then, you can implement those 12 clever organization projects to occupy a new space. That's it for now. Since you're still watching this video, press the like button, comment it, or share it with anyone close to you on your favorite social media channel. Browse and follow the Symphone website for more awesome content related to home and decor ideas. Until we meet again, later, sometime in the future. Thanks for watching.